Hey guys, Tonus here, and welcome to Overshill Hour, the show where I rant about fucking stupid shit. Today we're gonna talk about that one game that Overkill was wor working on. No, not Storm, but yeah, where, where the fuck is Storm? But we're gonna rant about Overkill's The Walking Dead. So, if you don't know what Overkill's The Walking Dead is, well, I'm guessing you know what it is. It's basically gonna be Payday 2, but with zombies. Yeah, that's basically what it is. It's a co-op game, four players, and you fight against zombies, or walkers. Yeah, I don't want you to show, so I really don't fucking care. But basically, there's gonna be two games. There's gonna be the VR-only experience that they're making for Star VR, and then there's the actual fucking game that was supposed to come out this year, but... Cause some fucking Chinese guys invested like 40 million dollars to them. They pushed it back to le next year. To the second half of next year. So they could make an Asian version of the game. And add more content. Okay. Adding more content. That's nice but. You do know you like announced the game back in 2014 right? It's been two years. We've had two trailers about it. One was just some fucking door being shown and some fucking girl yelling and then the second trailer was for the VR experience that was probably made in diesel cause only a few days after that they got the new engine that they're gonna make Overkill's The Walking Dead on so basically the game development has been like okay 2014, they announced the game. I'm guessing they've already been working on it for a bit. Okay, so f fast forward to next year, 2015. During E3, they buy a new engine called fucking, uh, what's it called? Uh, Valhalla. So, they need to recreate their entire game, their entire game from the ground up. I'm guessing that at least, unless it ha it's really similar to Diesel, but I really don't believe so. Well, it could be, but who knows. So, they're rebuilding the game on Valhalla. So, they have, like, one year till the deadline of 2016. Okay. So, fast forward, like, six months from July, or June. Ju June or July, one of those. Uh, fast forward to January, where they announced that Smilegate, those guys who made Crossfire, Invested 40 million dollars into Starbreeze, so Overkill is gonna make a new co-op version of Crossfire and make Asian versions of all the games they've made, so Payday 2 and Overkill's The Walking Dead. Which lead, which makes it so the game gets pushed to 2017, right? And yeah, in 2017, second half, so that's from July to December. I'm guessing it's gonna have a August or September release. That's my guess. Uh, Overkill's The Walking Dead is gonna come out at that point. But what I don't get is it's been like, yeah, two years now since they announced the game. And a lot of people weren't quite happy when they announced the game because they were expecting for something big. Because the Payday 2's birthday was close to the time when they, when they announced it. So basically, it's been two years, and we still haven't seen any fucking gameplay. I get it that you had to make two versions of the game, one is VR, one is, no, three versions, then, three versions, then the VR version, then the fucking America, the Western version of the co-op game and then the Asian version of the co-op game but so this E3 that was like last month they didn't show fucking nothing we only saw the biker heists and the character and the trailer and shit and then Raid World War 2 which I'm really fucking hyped for like I really want to play that fucking release the E3 demo please <laughs> but basically it's been two years and we still haven't seen any gameplay except for that VR trailer that we had, but that was built on Diesel. So, we haven't seen any footage of the new engine. Yeah, new engine. 
And even when I fucking googled for the new engine, I couldn't find any gameplay for it. Yeah. So, we don't know what the new engine will look like, and we don't know what the game will look like. All we know is, they're working on it. That's all we know. We haven't seen any in-game footage or nothing. Basically, what I wanted to happen was that in fucking on on at E3 2016 that we would have seen like some short gameplay trailer for the co-op game, like maybe uh something like the they did with the Payday 2, where they had a small heist, so bank heist, and they let people play it. But no, that didn't happen. So, even Raid had that. And Raid has been, like, in the works for a year now or something like that. And they still don't have a release date for that. But basically, Overkill, what I want you to do is show me some fucking gameplay. Okay? That's all I fucking want. Show me some fucking gameplay. That's all I'm asking for. So, like, this week, when I'm recording, there should be a new Payday update as well. I'm guessing, because there's teacher achievements. So, what I want is, let's say, Crime Fest, yeah. Well, if they're going to have a Crime Fest this year, because last year's didn't go that well, but... What I would want to see is somewhere, maybe during Crime Fest, because, you know, that's when you uh, have a uh, Payday's birthday. Like, the franchise is not Payday 2's, but the franchise's birthday. It would be nice if you maybe would show some gameplay of Overkill's The Walking Dead, so people would actually be excited for the game. Yeah, I really don't have anything else to say. I've, I've literally been repeating myself as well. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Like if you like if you like it. Dislike if you don't. Goodbye and a